Hello everyone, welcome back to Pharaoh, a new era. Let's continue the campaign. I think there are like two missions left. Okay, going back to Alexandria. Ooh, 10,000 people. A lot of culture. A mausoleum and a Caesarium. Kingdom of Intimity and, well, the usual stuff. This one is going to be probably a multi part one. 10,000 people is going to take a while to get there. Caesar's bloody death at the points of assassins' daggers cast the Roman world into turmoil and has driven you, our hero, Cleopatra VII, into grief and mourning. Gone is your lover, mentor, confidant, and powerful ally. Octavian, his teenage adopted great-nephew, has been named as heir, but the more experienced Mark Antony, previously a consul to Caesar, has become the nominal head of state, somewhat to the ire of the young Octavian. Not surprisingly, Caesar's will made no mention of your son by him, Ptolemy Caesar, popularly known as Caesarian. Desiring safety for yourself and your child, and, as always, seeking to preserve the power of Egypt, you have departed Rome for Alexandria. Despite all the leagues between Rome and yourself, you cannot leave behind all of its internecine squabbles. Powerful men still vie for power. Your support and the access to the riches of Egypt would be a great asset to any faction. For you to back a winner in this power struggle is critical. Siding with the loser could easily result in the end of Egypt. The dramatic showdown between the rival Roman factions recently occurred at Philippi, where Mark Antony's Caesarians decisively beat the forces of Brutus and Cassius. Antony, Octavian, and Lepidus have now carved up the empire for joint rule, with Antony claiming the eastern portion, which includes Egypt. Not long after the battle, Mark Antony summoned you to join him at Tarsus in Asia Minor, so that you might better explain why you had been slow to cast your lot with the Caesarians. Not one to be summoned like a lapdog, you wisely decline to respond. After all, you know better than most that it is much better to see a Roman under your own terms and conditions, not his. Thus you, Pharaoh Cleopatra, have returned home to Alexandria, to Egypt. It is now time to expand the glory of this magnificent city, founded by the great Alexander, whose tomb is still frequented by visitors. Alexandria's renowned Great Library continues to attract scholars from all over the world. The bright beacon of the wondrous Pharaoh's Lighthouse still burns so that seafarers can safely make their way through the treacherous waters of the harbor. Now you can further enrich the beauty of the city by constructing the expansive Caesarium in honor of your former lover and your young son. Additionally, ensure your own successful passage into the afterlife by building another mausoleum so that you can be duly worshipped after your journey into the field of reeds. The next time Mark Anthony calls for you, perhaps he will employ a bit more tact. Okay. The Mausoleum Alexander Library. Dynasty Mansion somewhere. Somehow here. A lighthouse. I need to build another mausoleum. Here, definitely, and the Caesarium probably be built here. But basically, this is the Alexandria map with a few changes here and there, but uh, no big changes. Okay, I have like a lot of cash. See the economy. So I can make barley and some grain, fish. Have some farmland here, but not a whole lot. Reeds and not much else. Alright, the main god. Okay then. 
Uh, this looks pretty good. Probably build a neighborhood somewhere around here. I need access to reeds. It's gonna be my main economical part. The bulk of it's here, which is kind of annoying, but not much I can do about that. Okay. Let's get the party started. One neighbor will be here. Or maybe here. Okay. I'll start here. I have everything at my disposal. This area will be industrial area. Neighborhood done almost. Need to keep an eye on the dynasty mansion. I'm gonna keep it there for now. Don't need a palace to start collecting taxes and whatnot. Seems fitting to be around this area. The rich neighborhood probably around here. Although it's not gonna be a big one. Done. Now I need production. Stabilize the economy. I'm gonna gather lots and lots of reeds. Don't have access to this area. Locked. Must be that walls. Let's try to rectify that. Yeah, they serve no purpose whatsoever, but... Uh Maybe they will fix it in the future. I'm 
Goody. So they have access to that area. Now let's start making lots and lots of papyrus. Probably need a dock somewhere around here. I'll probably need it so let's do that by papyrus yes please yeah papyrus again yes please Sells grain, I think I'm making that. Sells pottery, land trade route. Sells high shields and meat. That might be needed. Sells chickpeas. Yes, please. And buy papyrus. Expensive trade route, but. Uh, be good exporting over zero for now it's all I need probably some chickpeas as well and the trading dock Okay, that area is blocked. Exports done, imports more or less done, need food. Chickpeas here. Try to get some fish, but uh, that's for later. Now let's make some grain. Lots and lots of grain. Not very fertile, probably. Stinky ass road. as well. All 
all the grain in the world. All the grain for now. Let's make things pretty. I have both Senate House and Zoo. Great. Okay, initial setup done. Come on, my homies. I need hiding first for water. people Ooh, 353 people missing hey, hey. farming is going to be second priority Seven, yeah, fertility is not great. Well, buy chickpeas, because why not? And I do have some straw, but I don't know if I, it's any good. Can't make anything with it. Can I export it? Uh, let's see who, who buys it. Buy straw. Sure. Buy straw. Okay, I can live with that. Can make from here all the way here. Let's export straw. Hundred and sixty five still missing. Okay, got some wood. We'll probably need it for monuments and such. here a lot of grain being made <laughs> let's see damn need to make barley great Yes, great. And this is a source of export as well, so it's not all in vain. My service is in August. I should be able to fulfill the request. Just barley and probably start making some beer when I'll have more people available. And 
and starts throwing some festivals. Why not? Yep, boss. She is the best. be fixed. Should be buying a lot of chickpeas, but not much is happening in that department. Missing. Need to feed the entertainment. Which I would totally do. Okay. Let's do some of these. Entertainment there is going to be right here. to deposit that wine and this will do for now into some pottery importing pottery I don't think I can make it nope 
So far the economy is stable, so it's fine. We can make some beer. Start doing that. Please. Oh yes. Yeah, let's put pottery here and ban it from here. That's a little better. Pottery. Sure. Why not? Need to see what the heck do I need from this mausoleum. Need to import sandstone. The Caesarium. Don't think it needs that. Need workers. Well, let's do that and see what resources I need for it. They need desirability as well. Papyrus available. They will also need a dentist. Let's change a few things here. Export your 800. Some unemployment. Good. the entertainment and accept jewelry then to import some so I need to make my own stuff now Question is where to make it. Hmm. 
Okay, so this area is prime for that. Make some stupid ass jewelries. Yeah, that's a little better. That's a little better. More desirability. Yeah, I figured as much. Ten percent unemployment. It will depend on what I need here. Let's make more beer. That should lower the unemployment a little bit. And probably more food. do that it will probably need lots and lots of marble about to export the heck I cannot make my own marble let's see sells marble sure Might be the only source. 
think I open up all the trade routes that are available. Only marble here. I need to start importing the bloody sandstone. Might as well do it around here. need more than <laughs> these five. Beer. So let's do that. No weapons. Let's put them here in lack of any other location. Carpenter's Guild, yeah. Now let's fix that too. nicely I have crap ton of food now maybe I should start to export some of it Four 
34%. Nice. do they need okay carpenter I'm gonna pay 35 because I'm amazing oops need to import wood <laughs> yeah, it's probably far away. Better. Waiting period. Oh, this one is already full. Five months. Yeah. That's probably not going to happen. Yeah, that's 
not gonna happen. and one infantry but given the short amount of time not expecting any miracles here not opened no idea which one so I'm not seeing anything some copper then I don't know how much good that's gonna do though it'll be too late I'm sending what I have, which is well, and I don't have transport troops. Great. here because I have no choice Let's see. 
And I have some troops available, but... Uh, try to import some shields. Lot of marble available. So, where is my marble? Marble is nowhere to be found. Really hate these stupid ass bugs. It's just not being traded, period. Damn it. So annoying. Finally. I wonder if the city has any sites I could see while they unload Sight my of ship. that is very, very slow. It just stopped for a while. Ooh, granite. Great, and how much of it do I need? Don't know. It doesn't say. Let's go with 16 for now. And hope for the best. Not bad looking. Okay, that's about it for today. If you like what you saw, please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye.